Welcome to Old Bird Gaming. My name is Two. I am the Old Bird. We have a game today called Aporia. And this was this game was gifted to me by um, Kamoa, who is the god of the game. Kamoa is the god. And this is a first person puzzle game that apparently has a really nice soundtrack is what I've heard. And um, it's got a very, very engaging and beautiful environment. So we're gonna find out, oh, and not to mention, this game won, uh, I think, a few awards at least for best indie game of 2017. And it's got a really unique way of telling a story. Is That's, that's the, uh, the reviews that I've heard. So I am gonna be very interested in seeing what's going on here. Okay, game, take me away to your yeah, start a new game. To your magical world of beautiful penis and cock and a boob and food. Will there be noms in this game? Why are you still loading? This is taking a while. Come on, what do we got going here? I'm gonna turn this up, music. Oh, oh, hello, trees that pop into existence. That is really pretty. Aporia, beyond the valley, beyond the valley of sex, and into the caverns of nuns. Darn. Hope that's not where we're going. Ooh. Okay. So I'm gonna try to focus on this and actually put all the pieces together because um, if there's an interesting story in this game and it's puzzly, I, I, I need to be able to put all the pieces together and my brain is not too big. You know, I just got a little bird brain. So I, I'm waking up from my, I'm just getting out of my spa, you know, because that's what you do. Okay, I, yes, I know how to video game. Um. What's this? Okay. What that? Whoa, what was that? Well, that's a weird, weird pattern, like on a lens or something. That is, oh, that's weird. Okay. Uh, let's check this out. Is that, is that me with the sun? Hang on, we got, oh, there's all, they're all over the place. These, okay. So what we got up here is a table with, um, yeah. And these guy, okay. Assumedly there were dudes in here, but they're already gone. Uh, okay. So we got a, a green chick with, um, some plant. And we got a red guy who, the defender maybe? Um, black. Uh, the scribe possibly. Um, a guy with a loot, the musician. Oh, oh, wait, whoa. Oh, you're, oh, you're fucked. Our musician is fucked. How are we going to get down and jam now? Dude, unfuck yourself, come back alive and make the jam. We need somebody to drop the beat, yo. Come on. Okay, so that's, and I just woke up and I'm, I guess, uh, the sun person, light person. I don't know. <clears throat> okay, so this looks ancient and shit. Uh, all right. Like the blue fire, nice. Even though I've a, no, there's been apparently nobody here for a billion years, there's still fire burning somehow. That's an old trope in video games I wish they'd quit. You you wander into a cave that's been abandoned for a thousand years, there's still candles burning. You, you know those things only last a few hours, right? Okay. So there's all of the... There's all of the dudes. And I'm that one. And, um, okay. They're standing over some kind of city, it looks like. Uh, what? Okay. We'll do the, we'll do the thing. Why can't I, oh, oh! Bird guy! Oh, that's so cool! Oh, that's really neat! Bird guy. Hmm, one, one day the bird guy took a piece of stuff and he combined it with this other thing. Oh, and he made himself a bowl of soup. And then he poured it into a little flask and... Oh. And then he brought the bowl of soup 
to the the, the warrior, the defender, and the, the defender says, "What the fuck is that?" And he's like, "This is the best bowl of soup you have ever eaten." And it, oh, and it started glowing. Suddenly, the bird realized he had invented glow sticks, and the warrior said, "I will take that, and I will try it too." Oh, look at oh, that is the best glow stick ever. And and the, the warrior said, "Bird dude, you are the best thing ever." And so then the warrior comes over and he talks to all the other townsfolk, and he oh, he makes one for them too. We will all have glow sticks, he says. So that then we can go out and we can have a rave. Because we all want to have a rave. Our musician is still here. So we can have we can have glow sticks and a rave now. Shall us go? Yes, oh, oh, this is so cool. So they went to the spot where they would they were to have the rave. And once they got there, the warrior said, So, hold up your glow sticks and turn them on. And all everybody was shocked. Because they did not know these things could glow. Can we stick them in our mouth, they said? He said, no, do not put it in your mouth, because that is bad. But if you go over this way, then we can go over to the bird dude and we can give him big thanks in the form of blowjobs for the glow, for the glow stick that he gave us. It's like, you are amazing, bird. Here is a glow stick just for you. And um, then they opened it. The, they opened the door. Whoa. I mean, I'm making light of this right now, but that was actually really cool. That was actually really okay. Now I can move again. Whoa. Okay, so what do we does? We go. Okay. Um. Uh. Hello. Do I have to hold it down. Oh. Be wait. 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 Because the. Okay. Bonk. Ah. There we go. Okay. So I. I see how it works. I poured glow stick shit, glowy juice into the doors, and so apparently this planet is run on glowy juice. Oh, it's so pretty. Oh, look at this. Oh, this is gorgeous. I don't know why the running is a little bit, it's like fast, slow, fast, slow. I don't know why. What are we? Oh, this is so beautiful. Oh, I like this. I want to live here. Can I? Oh, can I get the sun to do that thing? Oh, yes, I can. Oh, my God. Whoa. Oh, this. This looks really good. This looks really good. That's oh, very pretty. This is a very immersive environment. I love an immersive, an immersive environment. I love that. I love it when a game can make me forget that I'm, that, you know, I live on Earth, or, or that you know, I'm playing a game. Just through the, through the look of it. I love it when there's, when there, you know, a game builds a world that makes it a place I want to actually be. And, and see for reals, for realsies. Um, can I, oh, I'm in here. Oh, um, I, I, I oh, oh, that's how you get out. Okay, so. Is there going to be a lot of... There, there's ruins here, so we know that much. Whoa. What is these? Oh, wait. Um... Huh? Oh! So it's also a light. So I can see things. What's this? Okay! So this thing has... It's, it's got juice to it, like you use it up. How do I get out of here? Does it use up when it's just being a light, or is it you only use up when you're opening doors with it? Oh. Oh, yeah, punch it! I'm a beast! I'll punch this door open, or this wall, fuck this rocks. Boom! Mm. 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 Beautiful! Beautiful rocks! They're so pretty! These rocks are so pretty! Everything is so... Ooh. Statue of birds? It's so pretty! Oh, wait a minute. Oh, there's more of this stuff around. Okay, so this is something I can collect. So I want to keep these things... I want to keep this thing full, I guess, as much as possible. So for when I need to open doors, I guess... What? Oh, that's just telling me how to duck. Okay, well, I know how to duck. Oh. Oh, oh, God, there's... Okay. Hang on a minute. There's so much stuff around here that I want to see, and, I, and it's making me... Making me... Oh. 
I can't go that way. Never mind. The big, big, ugly rock wall. But it's so pretty! It's so pretty! It's so pretty! It's so fucking pretty! Hello, thing that is pretty. Can I use... Okay, see, it does. Look, it uses up a little bit of juice there. Okay. So now we can... Okay, we gotta do it again, I guess. Because see that... Ah. Nice. Oh. I guess we're going down here, aren't we? Nice. I love the fact that I can take out of the... Oh my god, it's so pretty! Okay, so I'm gonna... We're going down the stairs. I already want to live here. I already... Oh, there's water. Can I... Am I okay with swimming? Am I good with that? Will swimming kill me? I don't know. Oh, I love that! Oh, that's nice! How the... How the little pads actually move out and they still stay attached to their stems down there? That's neat! This is really cool! Okay. Oh, it's a waterfall. Oh, it's so pretty! Um... Can I go in this water? I can go underwater! Uh-oh. And there are even things underwater. Okay, so we've learned that now. Ooh, that's a nice water effect. I like it. Is there anything over here? I'm gonna have to search a lot through this game, aren't I? I'm just gonna have to search for things. Because- oh, there is something over here. Don't, okay, my thing is full again. So I don't even know, uh... I don't even know yet what I'm supposed to be collecting, if there's anything to collect, or, or, uh... If there's not, or if I just have to keep my thing full, and... I... I trust the game will, like, show me. Games are usually good about that. Sometimes they're not. But most of the time, if you've got a game developer that has half a brain, then, um, they'll actually be able to, you know, tell you... They'll show you how to play the game, what you need to collect. They'll, they'll put it right in front of your face, and then you can go look for more of them later. Um... So pretty! Oh my god! So this is... Oh. Oh. Bonk. Does this game have day and night cycles? I mean, the sun is there. Whoa, hang on. Oh, okay. The sun is there, but... And it's a lot more sunsetty than it was before. So is the sun actually gonna go down? And it get dark? And I have to... Oh... You're dead. Okay. Oh, you're dead too. Why are there deads? Oh no! Oh no! That's terrible! Ah! Okay. So it looks like they died very suddenly. Uh... That's a mystery. That we will maybe be, be figuring out. Come on, why do you not work? Why not? Why not? Am I not pushing it right? What the hell? Oh, there's a- wait, there's another one! Where's it- where do- okay, hang on. I missed one. Where is it? Oh, I see- okay, hang on, I got this, I got this, I see where to go. I got lost. Got lost for a second there, but I think- yeah. It's down here somewhere. Where are you, little- little weird, ancient, glowy juice switch? There you are! I found you. Alright. Okay, so that... Give me that. I should... I saw another glowy thing over here, didn't I? Yes, I did. I should be able to open that door now. Right? Am I right? So we can see what's beyond the door! Is it a hot pocket? I would love it if there was a hot pocket beyond the door! Is this the hot pocket door, please? <clears throat> this was not the hot pocket door. This is the door of more stones. I love stones, but there's- man, there's a lot of them here. Okay, so we had pottery. We got boxes, so we had woodworkers. We had stonemasons. We had pottery makers. We had- oop. Oh, it's pretty! It's so damned pretty! My god, I want to wake up here. 
I want to wake up here next to you. Yes. After a lovely night of eating Hot Pockets. The sloppy, cheesy ones, too. Oh, I love sloppy Hot Pockets. Okay. This... Whoa. Um... Is this some kind of pulley lift system here? Whoa, whoa, it is! Okay. So I'm gonna get on this. I'm gonna go up. Whoa! Thing moves pretty good. Okay, what's up here? What's up here? Oh, look! More stones. This game's got a lot of rocks in it, tell you that. Dark in here. There we go. Okay, pottery. Oh. Bonk. Oh, they had nails. Okay, so they also had, uh, iron workers, I guess, and rope. Baskets. That basket. So, they're not, like, completely unadvanced civilization, whatever it was. Why is there nobody here? That's what I want to know. Uh, did you run off because there were no hot pockets? Is that why you left? Uh, oh, oh. Well, uh, looks like the game designers ran out of their... They, they got to the end of their give-a-shit level of, uh, skeleton models. We're repeating them now. So, yeah, well, we'll just, uh... We'll take that with a grain of salt. Um, oh. Well, see, I don't need any more. Oh. Did you... Did you try to drink the glowy stuff? I told you not to drink the glowy stuff. See, this is what happens when you drink it. You start glowing from the inside, somebody becomes really attracted to it, and they fuck you in the mouth, and then you die. That's what happens. I mean... Of course, there for a little bit before you die, you have glowy nipples, which that is amazing. Almost worth dying for, but not quite. If you had glowy nipples and hot pockets, definitely worth dying for. Absolutely. So, oh, that was a dip in the... Was that a dip in the map or was... Oh, I see. Okay. Mm, so we're up here. There's another bottle of stuff, but we don't need it. What's over this direction? I don't... Oh. Okay, see, I'm... Still... I'm not knowing quite yet what to what level I need to explore here. Because some games... They set up a, real, a whole lot of stuff that you can explore, but there's almost nothing you need to get. And other games... They, they just put shit everywhere that you need to get. So far, it doesn't seem like there's a lot I need to get. It seems like the only things that we have to collect are these, uh, these vials of, of glowy juice! What dragon did those come out of? And how did they get it? Ha ha! I want that job. Okay. Uh, let's see. Maybe Tyro can answer that one for me. Uh, okay. So we're up here at the top. Let me guess, this is where the elevator is, right? Okay, yeah, here's the elevator. It's over there, all right. Now, what is this? This looks like a thing. It is a thing. M. Ah, it's a piece of map. So, where am I? Where is the bird on the map? Map does me no good unless you show where the bird is. I don't know, maybe there's something I pick up later, another object or something that... Oh, that's cool. I love the way they actually make the directions for the game look just as iconic as the, uh, the, the paintings they have around. They make it look like part of, of the, the universe, like part of the writings that they, they make. That's cool. Oh, I don't need that. Okay, so it doesn't show where I am. I may have to just glance back at that now and then. Um... Okay. What do we got? What's up? Oh! Okay, y'all, we saw that back in the cave. Anything else? Well, you're dead. Oh, and you have a... You have something? Was that a crossword puzzle? I don't fucking know. Um... Well, whatever... Whatever it was, you... You died doing that. You... He, he died as he lived. Okay, so this is, um... Oh... So is there any way to get up to the top of this, or is this just a dead end? 
It looks like a dead end to me. Let's just give this a try. Bring up the thing. There it is. Will it go any higher? Nope, that's as far as it'll go. Well, damn. I was hoping to be able to get up there. Okay, so that ain't gonna work. Well, then screw you, place! I didn't need you anyway! I didn't want to be here! Did God want to be here? No! I didn't ask to be born! It's your fault! You're not my real dad! Um... So I'm getting a sense that, like... All these people... Are contributing something... To some... Central thing. And I think that central thing may be back in the cave that I started. Uh, I'm not sure. Oh boy, that's down. That's a lot of down. Okay. I'm gonna go the other way. I'm just gonna go over here and go the other way. You don't want me going up that way, game? Fine. I won't. I'll go the other way. I'll find something else. I don't need you. I need you to tell me what to do, where to go, who to be. I could be whoever I want to do. All right. Let's see. Oh. My nose is still. Oh. Looks like a fall. Oh, wait. Shit. I can't get back up. Okay, and it's saved. I guess I'm not supposed to get back up. What is this? A hammer. That's a. That's a hammer thing. Okay. Uh. Whoa! That's cool! Okay. I guess we're going on to uh, another place, because I'm not jumping down there. That would be death, I'm pretty sure. Oh, it's it's dark. It, what at? Whoa! Oh, it's guess I guess it's loading. Okay. Oh, what do we got? Oh, oh, oh. Um. The load in game. Jesus, uh, it's, it's okay. Take your time. Take your time loading. It's, it's nobody's in a rush here. <clears throat> okay. Well, we are now. Uh oh. Yeah, that's what I thought. We are now locked into a spooky cave. Spooky cave of wonders. Hopefully, spooky cave of wonderful hot pockets or dragons with glowy juice. Either way. Oh, dragons with glowy juice and hot pockets. Oh, I wanna please. Is that too much to ask? Can I just have that? Okay. Oh, we get another. Do we get another piece of story? We do. And then the lady saw that her friend had died and bird came to comfort the lady. Said, it's okay. Everybody dies. We're going to float her down the river so she doesn't smell. And then the bird came and to a field where he looked up at the stars and used his glowy light. And he had a rave by himself. But, oh, but during his rave, he accidentally grew some plants. And he took one of the plants and he... And he went back to his laboratory and he mixed the plant with some coffee and just a little bit of heroin. And so, and then he drank it and he discovered that it made you see all kinds of fun colors. Wait, oh, is he gonna die? Is, is this bird must be like their chemist or something or, or their scientist? Whoa, oh, oh, um. Oh, so he brought the plant. He brings the plant to. Wait, is that me? That's that's supposed to be me. I think that's me. It says, "Come walk this walk this way, talk this way." Oh, and he brings it. He brings the plant to a place where sick people are. Oh, and he shows her. He's making medicine. He shows her how to make the medicine. That makes you see funny colors. Uh, uh, and the woman 
Gives the... This is really neat. I love this. Oh, suddenly he feels better. She's shocked. And he's an old man. And... Whoa! He got rid of his cane. That's some... That's some good medication there. That's some really good meds. Shit. I mean, I could use those meds. I'm on a cane sometimes. And they had this stuff way back then invented by a bird dude somewhere? Why can't I have any? This is supposed to be in the modern age. What the hell? I'm gonna go... Oh. What? Oh, th that's not... Oh, that's not good. That's not good. That's hurting me. That's hurting me. Can I avoid that? Do I just not want to step on shit that looks like lava? What is this? Oh, I get to grow. Do I get to grow a medicine just like the bird dude? Well, hey, you know, we birds are good at growing medicines and. Oh, and it's going to heal me, isn't it? It is. Well, the question I have now is if I have a health bar, that means things in this game can hurt me. Uh, so I don't know what, but uh, I'll tell you what, we are going to find out. I love the game so far. I'm intrigued. It's so pretty. Look at it. Uh, and we're going to explore more of this later. This is going to be a more of a, I think, an exploratory game. So even though it is a puzzle game, but we're going to see what happens. Uh, and hopefully we'll get a really cool story out of this game. Um, so guys, thank you for hanging out with me today. And we will meet again in the next simulation. Until then. Yeah.